Good morning, guys, and welcome to Christmas Eve. Welcome to the McGrade family Christmas Eve tradition of where we go to the mall. Also, we parked on the top and literally no one else is here. But there's gifts that need to be bought today. <laughs> Oh, we'll do it would be hello vlog we've had a pretty successful morning you're getting a knife set who needs a knife set though the problem is we have a family gift exchange and each person needs to get a gift and we're having such trouble i don't know who watches youtube videos but like whoever does like i need to like go to like a mental Parker, my brother doesn't think you guys enjoy watching my videos. Please comment down below no, and I, tell him he's wrong. It's not that I don't doubt that you like him. It's just I question <laughs> your intelligence level because you watch them no. and you find them engaging. Okay, so everybody hold up your items. Hold well, on, I get to hold my purse. Thanks. <laughs> yes. <Yeah. laughs> Hello guys, we are back from the mall now and I am going to start wrapping presents because I always wait till the very, very last second to do so. Most of the gifts me and my sister bought together like a group effort. So she wrapped some of them, but I have to wrap my mom's gift and the family gift exchange gift. So let's do that. Okay, so this is what I got for my mom. This is the Bay's Weekender, which is like a travel bag. It's like the best travel bag ever. And it's for like, you know, like weekend trips. The best part is the bottom part here zips off and it's like a built-in packing cube. Literally the perfect weekend carry-on travel thing. And also if you have like your carry-on roller you can unzip this and you can stick it through the little handle. It's perfect. The lighting is so bad here. So I don't know how I'm gonna wrap this. Let's see. I like wrapping with wrapping paper. I hate like just shoving everything in a bag. You know what I mean? It's more fun to like rip open the paper, I think. Oh no, there's not very much. There's not very much left. Oh, there's like nothing. Do we have no wrapping paper? Wrapping paper secured. Okay, let's do sparkly Santa. <laughs> You think I'd be good at rapping because I'm creative, but I'm actually terrible. Hell yeah. 
perfect, perfect, perfect. <sighs> oh my gosh, I'm so tired. <laughs> Okay, well, it's been a long day already and it's only like 1.30, but I haven't even started editing the vlog that I'm supposed to post today. So I'm gonna do that in a second. But first I wanted to show you guys, my friend got me like a custom Taylor Swift calendar for Christmas this year and it just came today. And guys, you're gonna be so jealous, especially since this is like she custom made this so you can't really buy it. Look at it. It's a custom 2023 Lavender Midnights edition calendar it's with all the Taylor Swift lyrics. Like, look how cute this is. She made this on Photoshop and it looks like the Midnights album and it has all the months on it and each month has a different lyric and like all of the lyrics are like related to the month so for the first one it has we could leave the christmas lights up till january and that has like you know midnight's theme so cute look at this and because we're going to the tour she starred the days that we're going to the tour next year do you really want to know where I was April 29th in April? I actually didn't realize how many lyrics Taylor Swift uses like almost every single month. Like the best and worst day of June was the one that I met you. You all over me. Of course this one had sent me. This you know last kiss July 9th with the plain window like ugh. Literally so amazing. That July 9th beat your heart. Back to December. So shout out to Maddie for making me my own Taylor Swift calendar. I was getting worried because I couldn't find the new calendar. They were like all sold out already for next year. And so I don't have to worry about it because I have my own personal Taylor Swift calendar that I'm obsessed with. So she made this on Photoshop. So if you guys wanted to make your own Taylor Swift calendar, I guess nothing is stopping you from using Photoshop if you can. I could never. Like this is like way above my skin level but so beautiful Welcome to the gift exchange. So here's the, the rules. So you pick a number and then you unwrap a gift and then, you know, you go through all the numbers and then you get to steal them. Parker, do you want your dogs on the internet? <laughs> <laughs> For free? <laughs> the Yellowstone belt buckle. Oh. <laughs> Can I sell this on eBay?
Merry Christmas guys. I hope you all had a lovely Christmas and happy holidays. And I am grateful to say that this is the last day of Vlogmas. It has been a very long month with its ups and downs, but I am happy that I can finally just relax and enjoy the holiday. Last year on my Vlogmas, I did a what I got for Christmas video. So I am gonna show you guys what I got for Christmas. But this year my family is kind of doing a family trip instead of giving a lot of gifts so there wasn't a ton for us to open but we still did get each other some things so I'm just gonna show you guys what I got well first my best friend gave me this um, a couple days ago and it's so cute it's a tote bag that says Taylor's version on it in maroon so cute I love tote bags I hate purses but I love canvas bags so this is a really good one and then from one of my stocking stuffers I got some hoops because I wear my hoops every single day I used to like they used to be gold but like I wore them so much that I like it like rubbed off and they're now silver which is so funny so my mom got me new hoops hopefully these are a little more heavy-duty than the other ones because I'm pretty sure the other ones I got like super cheap my best friend also got me my favorite candy in the world which is peanut butter M&Ms as you guys kind of saw on my like second day of vlogmas uh, I opened presents with my friends my other friend got me that really cute cute keychain with anti-hero on it but she also got both of us the coaster for midnights that look that's like this kind of tile coaster but it hasn't come in yet it looks like midnights but it's you know a coaster but it hasn't come in yet so that's coming yesterday on Christmas Eve at the mall um, my brother for some reason always waits till then to buy me a gift and so we went into cotton on and they had these sweatpants on sale for $15 each so he got me two of the sweatpants which I love literally live in sweatpants. They are the best. I love loungewear. So we've got a neutral colored one and then we also have like a burnt orange pink um, one. So very excited about my new sweats. And then I think this is my favorite gift that I got from my mom. You guys know if you've been with me for a very, very long time, I love my cupcake pajamas. I've had them forever. Flannel pajamas with cupcakes on them. And I, I've literally had those since I was like 13. So it was time for an upgrade so my mom got me the same brand of pajamas the same flannel pajamas except this one has espresso martinis on it which I'm obsessed with because I love espresso martinis and I love flannel pajamas so this made me so happy and on the sleeve it says <laughs> espresso yourself <laughs> Yeah, so that's pretty much all that we opened today, but uh, we are going on a family trip in a week week and a half so I'm just really excited about that and for me I love experiences like I value experiences much more than like physical gifts you know what I mean I love quality time I'd rather go with you to a concert than you buy me something really expensive I like you know sharing like a memory together so I'm really excited about our trip but thank you guys for being here for all of vlogmas if you have been I have not been able to edit the past two days but I will be getting the rest of the content up probably tomorrow so then I could take the week and just relax and reset for the new year because I always like to revisit my goals, make um, an end of year recap year in review video so that will be posted on the 31st so look out for that. That will be my last video of the year and then I'm gonna take off a couple weeks to reset and plan for the next year. I think I'm going to end it here because I'm just gonna go spend some time hanging out with my family. This is going to be the end of Vlogmas. Thank you guys so much for being here. I hope you guys have a happy holidays week and take time for yourself before the new year. But yeah, I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.